Hey everybody, welcome back to the vlog and today I'm super excited to share with you a review of this new product that I was uh, gifted at a local conference and I'm super excited to share with you this, this awesome thing called Game Set Math. Oh, game Set Math, as you can tell, is obviously a play on Game Set Match from the rules of tennis. And it's used with these tennis balls that are printed with this high quality, uh, I don't know how they did this, but it's actually a good quality printing. Now someone said to me, well they're just tennis balls that you wrote on with a sharpie, and, and they're not. Because those would rub off, or those would get damaged, or they would wear off over time. These are actually printed on really, really, really well. I've scratched at these, I've tried, honestly, I'm sorry Jan, but I've, I've tried to scratch these off and they don't come off, so these will last with your students. So let's get into what game set math actually is. So at the recent, uh, I say recent, but it was in March, the Illinois ASCD Pre-KK Conference that's held every year in Schaumburg. It's an amazing event. If you ever get the chance to go, go to it. You will not be sorry. Uh, my buddy Pete Harry and I from Harry Kindergarten Music were walking around and we stopped by this booth called Game Set Math. And this wonderful lady named Jan approached us right away and said, can I show you guys our product? And of course we were both like, yeah, let's check it out. We love doing fun things with our students. This definitely falls into my philosophy of learn through play and Matt, that, that hashtag that I like to use, math is more than a worksheet, right? And making math fun. And that's exactly what her and her company have done. So uh, in the most basic form, what game set math is, it's a set of these tennis ball shaped balls, right? that have numbers zero to 30 on them. And like I showed you, they're printed on their really, really good, sturdy, high quality material. They're, they're on there really, really, really well, okay? And then along with it, there are lists of games. Now they do have a website that's game-set-math.com. We'll put that down below. But the list of games that she gave me has 10 games for four to six year olds and 10 games for five to seven year olds. Now. As with anything we've talked about before on my channel, don't let age range limit you, right? Because I took this into Trisha's classroom. Trisha teaches second grade. She's got seven, eight, and nine-year-olds, and we played it, and you'll see in some of these videos how much fun they had, right? So we went through, and we just picked out some games, and the two that I did with Trisha's students were Let's Compare. It's a game using comparing numbers and identifying less than, greater than, equal to, and we actually got out marker boards and dry erase markers to do more with that. And then we also did Give Me Five, where a student has to randomly reach in, blindly pick one of the game set math balls out of a pile and give five math facts about that number, which is a great concept to be able to do like that, right? Like knowing as much as you can about a single number. Now, one thing that makes this game even better than just the fun of it is how easy it is to use. So before I ever played this with Trisha's class and actually sat down, sat down and taught this to them, just to see how it works so that you could do this with, with you know, fresh out of the, the game set math bag or with a sub or with whoever, Trisha got this ready, highlighted two games she wanted to use, handed this to a parent volunteer who had never seen it before and said, here, try these with my students, and they did it just like that. So it's a very, very simple, easy game to implement in your classroom right away that your students could be using to learn through play all the time. So it is amazing in that sense. Uh, I, I love, like I said, the quality of these. It comes with this nice little tote bag, it's got all the games you need to play on there, and then because it's just so simple to use, it's easy to create your own games, whether you're just lining up numbers in order or talking about values, whatever it may be. So again, there are a list of 20 games that I have. I'll tell you some right off the top of my head that were fun. Put in order, so just for your little ones, taking all the balls and just laying them in order. And we did that together with her second graders. Seems like a simple concept maybe for second graders, but they loved it, right? They absolutely loved doing that. And you'll see in the video here that I'll show you at the end. Uh, put them in order for a different number. Maybe do counting by fives. Find the zero, the five, the 10, the 15, the 20, right? So you're counting by fives that way. Uh, make 10. Use addition, putting together, and adding and subtraction to take apart and taking from. Pass out game set math ball 0 to 10. Have each student find their complement to make 10. One student will not have a partner. Why? The answer is there's only one 5 ball, right? So they have to figure out how they can make different concepts or different number combinations to get to 10. So I'm going to leave you with a little video of the kids playing just so you can see how much fun they really had. But my review of this is two thumbs up. So Jan and her team, her company, awesome, awesome job. Kudos to you guys. All of you go right now, check out www.game-set-math.com. You're going to find everything you need there. Check it out there. Reach out to her. See how you can get your hands on one of these. Hopefully you'll see them at a conference somewhere near you. That's how I found Game Set Math and they were super lovely ladies to chat with and uh, 
thank you for the product because it really, really, really is awesome. So teachers that want to have some fun learning, learn through play, making math more than a worksheet like we like to talk about a lot, right? Uh, go check out Game Set Math. Here's a little video showing you exactly how much fun Trisha's students had with it. Enjoy. Enjoy.